To get started, we would open a video clip first. For that, go to File, Import, and then click on Media. Select the video clip and click OK. The video clip will appear on the project media list. Click and drag it onto the project timeline. It will ask you to match the project settings with the settings of the clip that you have just imported. Depending upon your preferences, you can choose yes or you can choose no. The clip will then appear on the timeline. You can use the mouse scroll wheel to zoom in or zoom out of the timeline. To split a video clip, first make sure that you have that clip selected in the timeline. Then click at any point on the clip to move the cursor there. The cursor location is from where you can split the video. You can also use the next and previous frame buttons to move the cursor frame by frame. Once you are happy with the location of the cursor, simply press the S button on the keyboard. The editor will then split the video from that point. To cut a certain portion of a video, first we need to select that portion. To do that, move the mouse to this area. Then, hold down the left mouse button and move the mouse right or left to select a region. Once the region is selected, make sure that the video clip included in this region is also selected. Now, you can either press S, which will then split the region into three parts. Or, you can press Delete to cut or delete the selected region. To crop a video, click on the Event Pan and Crop button of the video clip that you want to crop. This will open the Video Event FX window. In this workspace, you can change the position and rotation of the video clip. You can also crop a video by changing its scale, like I am doing here. This tool also allows you to incorporate animations in your project, but that will be looked upon in another tutorial. Once you are happy with the results, simply click Cancel. You can see that a portion of the video has been cropped out. I hope you have found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more straightforward tutorial like these. Thank you for watching.